Hey guys, welcome to the top 5 free editor extensions for October 2017. And number 1 is the PDT item spawner and this suggests that it will be free until the next update and I'm not sure where um, the update is going to be but if you want to pick it up while this you know video is active. So it's an item spawner which is a lightweight system which allows you to randomly spawn um, objects or items which were directly um, with the solution extracted from the procedural dungeon toolkit and it allows you to supply a prefab and set up spawn locations um, with scripted objects and you can easily control um, you know if one item wants to be spawned one time in one scene you can control wherever it's um, actually specified to be spawned with a simple GUI script. Number two is an asset called Aero Blocks. Now um, like with any of these that I show, I'm not sure how good any of these are, but it might be another one if you're looking for this type of thing. So it's an editor extension tool which allows you to sort of help build aerodynamic models and things like aeroplanes and turbines. And it's got a simple UI that allows users to create and join the blocks together. And it, um, there's an aerodynamic model which makes blocks behave actual aerodynamically. And there's also other elements which help you easily create propellers and turbines. Number three is the delighting tool and this is a tool specifically around the um, sort of pipeline of photogrammetry when people take you know a lot of pictures of a specific item from the real world and you can bring it into um, you know the PC and you can make a sort of very photorealistic object out of it. Now this is something and a tool which allows you to take the actual shadows and lighting information away from the actual object that you've scanned in. So if you're interested in the photogrammetry sort of pipeline um, you can choose find this way to actually take away the shadows and you know do the own shadowing and lighting when you need to in the engine. Number four is an interesting one called Ed Games, and this is uh, a little sort of editor extension which adds some games to the actual editor itself and will, you know, give you some examples of how to do it. So you can see that there's a bubble game and a Tetris game which you can add um, when you import these scripts, and you can just go to Window Games and it will do a little pop out and you can play some like, little games in the editor, um, which might be fun if, you know, you're getting bored at one point. And number five is the large terrain generator and this helps you easily generate a large terrain with double resolution and it generates a realistic terrain can be used in the editor or at runtime with a maximum resolu resolution of 8000 by 8000. Just add the terrain generator component to a game object and define the parameters that you need um, based on the things that you see here. And then it will create one large um, terrain which contains four smaller terrains. So if you want other tools to generate trees and grass, you have to use them in each of the sort of specified small terrains. So it's just an easier way to create something really large if that's what you're looking to do. These were the top five editor extensions for October 2017. I'll put all the links in the description so you can check out everything from this month. So thanks again for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.